this will be my first time using my new RV. It's a windy day. Right on the lake. Are you my, what? It's recording? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Read my lips, Will. <laughs> You're like behind the phone. I'm like, huh? What are you? Trying to get you to read my lips. <laughs> well, this is where we are gonna go fishing down there. I don't know if you can see how steep this is. Uh, so we're a little afraid of the camper rolling right into the water. Uh -huh. We got some wood steps <laughs> down there. Hopefully that won't happen tonight. Uh, yeah, about to start a fire or at least put some logs out for a fire um, and then very authentic camping we're gonna get a uh, seafood buffet that they have so so this is the hill that my state park book went flying down all the pages started coming out so I did chase it did get it all we are the ultimate outsiders so we're gonna get our our stamp this weekend. Turn it off. <laughs> And it's a very extremely windy day. It's, it's March the 6th, camping with my son. We're gonna have a great weekend. First time in a camper. We're gonna do some fishing. And yeah, about to go eat some seafood too. Mm. <laughs> We're going to the famous restaurant. So we are going to eat at the famous park. Famous. Famous restaurant tonight here at the park. And we're gonna have seafood. But we're 15 minutes too early, so we're gonna take a walk. Right, Will? Yes. Yeah. I know we're camping and all, but we just had to have the experience of this restaurant, so. That's kind of a big park, a big, She said people come from all over just to go to that restaurant. And that's all we gonna eat. <laughs> I'm just a swinging. <laughs> go higher. <laughs> Amazing 
So this park is so amazing. It even has a swimming pool. So very cool. There's so much to do here that we don't even know where to start. It's our first night, it's Friday night. So there's my son. Hi, William. <laughs> kind of have you zoomed in a little bit there. Whoops. It's night one camping, our first night on Friday night. First time in the camper, went from tent camping to RV camping, and still gonna be in a sleeping bag. It's cold outside, so we have a heater going right now. So that's a big difference for us. All right, so our first night camping, um, it's a lot different than it used to be. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Uh, back then there was no electricity. Now we got lights going, microwave, fridge, got stuff pulled ready. Got our coffee maker ready to go in the morning. Um, some of these outlets aren't quite working, so we'll have to make another video and figure out what we're gonna do to have coffee in the morning. But worst case, we got heat going, got the thermostat set, got a nice shower. It's going to be nice. It's going to be a lot easier. And we have a TV. And there's the TV going. Well, it's or not, it's not on going, but <laughs> yeah, nice. Plenty of lights. Love it. This is awesome. Good morning. Good morning, Will. It is way too cold. <laughs> but we, yeah. Okay. Camping was good, but could not resist this buffet style food. Last night was too good and thought about it. We could either work hard cooking food or just come get some good old country grits. When I first booked this camp site, this camp number, site number eight, is we were planning on tent camping. And that's before I ran across this really good deal on this cute little RV that I love, love, love. And so, we found out today that this particular campsite is for tent camping, so we did get our little RV up in here. Walk into the showers for a hot shower. Get these teeth brushed. Yeah. No primitive camping going on here this weekend. <laughs> I so wanted a hot shower, but that shower just had a little drizzle and it never, it already had like soap all over me. So I was just happy to have that little teeny hot water. Um, the new RV that we have cannot figure out how to make the water hot yet. So, but I'm not complaining. There is a lot of fishing going on on the lake. We have actually sit here and watch them pull in fish today. The Galibu house was once part of the French Huguenot settlement. It was constructed of rough hewn timber by Andre Galibu in the 1770s. Andre Galibu was a skilled carpenter who displayed his craftsmanship in construction of his pioneer log cottage in New Bordeaux, Old Abbeville District, South Carolina. The living quarters consisted of a large sitting room with a huge stone fireplace, a dining room with four bedrooms downstairs and a most unique stairway to the second floor consisting of two more rooms. At one time, there was a spinning wheel and a loom for making thread and cloth. There was a smoke house the family used to cure and store their meats. The water supply came from a spring down the hill. 
the garden was used to grow such things as mullein, mint, whorehound, and more that were brought from France. Many of the herbs were used for medicinal purposes. Andre Galibou served in the American Revolution as a private and sergeant with the Bordeaux Regiment of Abbeville, South Carolina. He was wounded in the hip and walked with a limp until the day he died on September 12, 1814. Joseph Brown of Charleston, South Carolina, who helped build Fort Sumter, married Mary Galibou. They reared six daughters and four sons. Mary Galibou lived to be over a hundred years old. The Galibou House is the last of an upstate settlement of the French Protestants who fled France to escape religious prosecution. The house was renovated and modernized with heating and air conditioning, bathrooms, and a kitchen and now can be rented out to visitors of the state park. You know, oftentimes people ask me, how do you do so good at catching sticks and logs and trees? I think it's a gift. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I'm gonna stand back.
My highlight of this camping trip was waking up when the temperature was 45 degrees, freezing my butt off, and turning the heat on, and turning that to 73, letting it get nice and hot, and then going out for breakfast at that resort restaurant that they have at the campsite, um, and having uh, those grits for breakfast. Those are probably the best grits I've ever had. And then the shrimp from the seafood night before, that was awesome. It was a great day. My highlight for this weekend was, of course, camping with my son. And also, I really, really loved the restaurant here. It was definitely a highlight. All the food that we brought to cook, we did not cook. We only got into our snacks. So, we ate at the restaurant the whole time. So, and that's not something that normally we do a lot of is eating out. So, um, that was our highlight. It was a fabulous restaurant. I would recommend if anybody comes to this park, do not bring food to cook because you will want to eat at the restaurant. And it's just been a really great weekend. It's our last night. Trip, trip. What are you doing? Well, this is the one thing that we brought that I am eating since everything else we brought has been in the fridge and stayed in the fridge this whole time. Um, everything else we eat has been at the restaurant, the famous restaurant at this famous state park. Um, and yeah, I figure maybe we wouldn't take everything we bought back home, but we're pretty much taking everything we bought back home. Not if you eat it. <laughs> well, this is the one thing that we brought that I am eating, and you can't have any. <laughs> Actually, that was my deal. Uh, you, you can have the salsa. <laughs> this is, the guacamole is all mine. Oh, you about to share it. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. All right, so we went to park to go to the restaurant. Um, forgot that we had the RV, so we're in this tight little parking spot. Um... And mom thinks she's gonna back up. I say just drive over the curb, go through the grass, and exit. I don't know what she's gonna do. This is terrible. She's afraid of getting in trouble. I would have just drove over the grass. So we're gonna see her T-ball in a parked car. Just come this way. There's a car in front of me. That's okay. No, 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 no. Oh gosh. She's gonna flip the camper over. She's got enough room. I don't think she'll clip that car. And if she does, we'll just leave without getting breakfast. It's cool. You got enough room. Can we just pick up the camera? <laughs> no, just come this way. You won't clip the car, probably. She'll probably clip the car. And that's okay, we've already checked out, so nobody will know. Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't believe I forgot I had it on there. <laughs> so, yeah, we were just going to park along the road, completely forgot we had the camper. Yeah, she's got so much room. You're good. Ah, you're good. You're, you're just so good. I'm super sure. You're good. <laughs> Alright, let me get set up. This video is brought to you by Heinz Ketchup. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we finally parked. I don't know. What do you want to say? Alright, so we finally parked. Oh, wait, this gotta be a pause. We're just really, we're really, uh, we just like. No. Not over the vehicle parking situation. No, so if you look out the window, we are just parked uh, 
parked on the road, parked on the pavement. Just came to a stop, got out the car, you know. Yep, and we're on the way out and we're having our breakfast, so. Been clicking cars? <laughs> yeah, not this time, not today. So. Yeah. Oh yeah, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> we're really not talking to ourselves. We're, <laughs> <laughs> kind of video <laughs> yeah. You want to be in a video? Come around and say hello. Just say hello. Hey, how y'all doing? Yeah. Yeah. So we had this famous time. restaurant. Right? He made some great grits. Like, awesome. <laughs> and we loved our favorite part of this part was this restaurant. Yeah, we didn't cook any of the food we brought. We just you guys here. Yeah, we, yep. you, you didn't see the episode that we had outside with the... So, we actually pulled into the parking, forgot that a camper was on there. I said just drive over the grass. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I wanted to eat and not go to jail, so... I'm like, okay. hey, we already checked out. If we hit somebody, we'll just leave, you know. No. <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, just leave. Kind of <laughs> kidding. <laughs> I was just pulling up your video. Oh, uh, were you? You're not finished yet, right? Uh-uh. Uh okay, I was just pulling up your website on YouTube and everything. So, are uh, And you're going to... Oh, oh. You're coming back, right? We are. We had so much okay. fun here. Can I take a picture of you guys? You can. Okay. <laughs> All right, stop the video. All right, so this has been absolutely amazing. Uh, the staff has been awesome. Everyone's been way so friendly. Um, thanks guys for making the recommendation. It was a great camping experience. Uh, leave a comment below letting us know the next place you'd like us to go um, so we can leave a video about it. And don't forget to like, subscribe to my channel, live simple, collect memories, and just have a great time. And Bye. record yourself doing it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, bye guys.